and here's the video that you use ha uh, just half percent and uh, you you know, spray them on, you, you make it dry. Okay, half percent can generate a really high beating effect at a lower concentration. That's way lower than you're using the detailing. So that, you know, after you apply it on the dry, you spray the water on, you can see the water just break on the, you know, on the surface really well. And re keep in mind that this this hood we, we, we use is really old oxidized paint. So it don't give you much uh, uh, perfect, uh, you know, water bead. If you use on the on the on the on the good car, the newer car with a clear coat, and it will bead like a you generate a lot of bead, perfect bead. And then you say, okay, I want to create the uh, a ceramic effect other than just beading. Okay, the ceramic effect, you know, is really not the the uh, 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 easy to show in car washes. It's more on, on the detailing side, which is you hand apply it, even though you don't use a you know you know a detailing. Uh, waxes or uh, reactive silicones just with the QS100 base and you dilute it in water at a higher concentration. You spray them on, on the car, you wipe them dry, that still can create the, uh, uh, that ceramic effect. And here's the video to show that. Okay, you see that we hand apply that and then you pour the water on, it's just nothing stick. The water will not stay on the surface. All of them run down from surface. Even you have dirt, they will, they will, they will wrap the dirt and, and they roll down from surface. They give you really durable protections, but it's not the true ceramic, but that I call the ceramic coating effect. Okay, so you, you can use QS100 to generate that effect if you need, okay?